So we're doing a review. Like, how do you find your assignment again today? Um, you can go access it through content, and then it would be under Unit 2, Narratives. And I have some videos explaining the different pieces in here. That's kind of small. Um, I have different videos explaining the different things that I went over on Tuesday. Um, but the assignment is in here. So I would suggest that you do the assignment in Google Classroom. It's going to be a lot easier for me to give you feedback that way. So I put a link to Google Classroom in here. If you don't want to use my link um, and you like have Google Classroom bookmark or you want to use the waffle, this Google waffle, it's a shortcut. That's totally fine. So we're going into classwork. We're opening up narrative assignment. And there's a directions and example in the Leggett narrative. The one that you are writing in and the one that you are going to turn in will be the one titled narrative. So I've done, I've done a few examples for you. Um, on Tuesday, we looked at the direction. So we're going to go over the directions one more time. And then I'm giving people time to, to ask questions. And I'm going to be looking at your submission so far. So directions. This piece is longer than a CER, so I recommend writing it in a Google Doc and copying and pasting it. If you're going to do K-12, if you really like K-12 and you want to stick with that, cool. Or just do it in Google Classroom and don't worry. So what are we doing? Pick one of the short stories we have read and explain what happened from two of the characters' perspectives. So you're going to tell the character story as if you were them. Um, explain their motivations, their actions from their point of view, and we're going to try to do it in their own voice. So you could do a journal entry, or you might be more comfortable setting it up interview style. Uh, and maybe your interviewer is asking, what were your initial thoughts at the time? What were your motivations? What, do you regret your actions? How do you think the other guy feels? These can be guiding questions if you're doing a journal style that you should still be answering these questions. You, it just might look a little different. Okay, so then how, what's, what's the details? We're looking for 300 to 500 words. That's about half a page, okay? for each character. Um, what that means is that total you're looking at a page, maybe a page and a little smidgen. Um, so we're doing a word count. I have in here the list of the characters. So if you decide to do Lamb to the Slaughter, these are the characters for Lamb to the Slaughter. If you decide to do the interlopers, these are the best characters to choose for interlopers. And there's a little description about them to help jog your memory so that you can write in that voice. I gave you an example of an interview style, and this is just the beginning. This is not a complete, this is not a complete assignment. This is the beginning to give you some ideas. Hi, Maria Elena. Hi, Selena. Good morning. So what I've done is one section is from, from Patrick's point of view. The other section is from Mary's point of view. And where I left you off on Tuesday is I said, get on into this narrative and let's start typing in here so it's not as scary to look at a blank sheet of paper. So the very first thing that you can do, whether or not you know what story you want to do, um, is put your name, put the date. Um, this is my name. That is how you spell my name. Um, this is the class we're in. This is the assignment we have. So this is a standard. Uh, this is a standard header for a writing assignment. And then I suggested you do some brainstorming on this page. And then I showed you what might it look like to start with a journal entry. And so. Um, I picked that I was one person, and then at the end, I will like sign off with that person's name. Um, and I'm trying to trying to put my myself in their shoes. What are they thinking? Um, that kind of thing. Okay, 
So let's get to work and let me answer your questions.